We we'll begin with China's space program. The lunar probe Chang'e 3 landed on the moon in December 2013 and is still working. The State Administration of Science, Technology and Industry for National Defense says it is the longest working time ever for a lunar probe. For two and a half years, Chang'e 3 has collected a great amount of data and images, helping answer many important scientific questions. We now get more from CCTV's Jing Xiao. New research findings in the human lunar exploration endeavor, made possible with high-tech devices on the Chang'e lander, a camera, an optical telescope, and an extreme ultraviolet imager, exploring the moon, the universe, and the plasma sphere around the Earth. First finding the world's first lunar geological map, made with radar. The map shows the structure 330 meters under the lunar surface and reveals a new rock, lunar basalt. The radar detected three layers of basalt under the ground, especially that the top layer was 195 meters deep. The survey found the lunar soil is five meters deep, almost double what other countries had found. In observing the universe, the Chang'e 3 for the first time used an optical telescope. The lack of an atmosphere on the moon makes it ideal for viewing, and the telescope helped prove that there is no water on the moon. We measured the contents of water on the lunar surface and above, and got the historically smaller value, which is also in line with the expectations of the experts on the formation of the moon. The Chang'e 3 lander uses the world's first extreme ultraviolet imager to get images of the plamosphere. The plamosphere is about 40,000 kilometers from the Earth's surface. It can block the interference of solar wind and most of the cosmic rays to protect the Earth. The Earth's plasmasphere is in the innermost of the Earth's magnetosphere. If the magnetosphere has interference, the shape, position, and structure of the plasmasphere will be affected. Therefore, by detecting the structure and evolution of the Earth's plasmasphere, we can monitor the influence of the solar activities to the Earth. The Chang'e 3 made China's first successful soft landing on the surface of an extraterrestrial body. Since the 1990s, China has had four missions to the moon only second to the United States, which has had five. China's research findings are recognized by global counterparts. Jane Chow, CCTV.